Hi, my name is Alfisa, this is Retina Coach. Today we'll continue discussion on different vitrectomy systems. If you haven't watched our previous videos, I encourage you to visit our retinacoach.com website and also our YouTube channel. In this video, I will dive into the menu bar of Bausch & Lomb Stellaris Elite Vitrectomy Machine. And of course, I remind you that this video prepared for educational purposes only. I want to especially thank Rob Nelson, who is Surgical Device Manager at Bausch & Lomb. His extensive knowledge of Stellaris Elite Retractomy System and also amazing explanation helped me to create this video. So thank him and check this video out. The Stellaris Elite System was first introduced in 2017. When using a single port retractor that cuts only in the forward direction, the cutting crate of this system can reach up to 7,500 cuts per minute. However, by utilizing a bi-blade pneumatic cutter that can cut in both the forward and backward directions, the cut rate can be doubled to 15,000 cuts per minute. In this video, my focus will be on the various settings and sub-modes of core vitrectomy. For better illustration, we recorded how vitrectomy machine sounds in different sub-modes, which I think is pretty cool to compare. In fixed cut sub-mode, the cut rate doesn't change. We just have a linear vacuum and cut on or off, clicking to the right and reflex clicking to the left. The vacuum gradually increases while pressing the pedal down to the floor, while the cut rate stays the same. Then the right side click turns off the cutting and leaves only the vacuum. One more side click turns on the cutting back. The next sub mode is called linear vitrectomy. In this sub-mode, both the cut rate and vacuum change, and for both, the highest and the lowest value are set in advance. In this sub-mode, at the starting position of the pedal, the cutting is at its highest value and the vacuum at the lowest. And then, while pressing the pedal down, the cutting gradually decreases while the vacuum is increases. Then again, the right side click turns off the cutting and leaves on the vacuum. One more side click turns on the cutting back. The next sub mode is dual yaw vacuum. Here, both the cut rate and vacuum are not permanent. Unlike in collinear vitrectomy, this change occurs independently one from each other. In this sub mode, in pitch, which means pressing straight down on the pedal, Cutting rate will increase, and in yaw, which means sliding the pedal to the side, in our case to the right, the vacuum will gradually increase. Now the pedal is in pitch, and you can hear how cutting increases while pressing the pedal down. Sliding the pedal to the right turns on the vacuum and gradually increases it while sliding more to the side. Stand with the pedal to the side and down position allows to use both cutting and vacuum. Dual yaw cut sub mode is the reverse version of the dual yaw vacuum. In pitch here there is a various vacuum levels and in yaw various cutting crates. While pressing the pedal down to the floor the vacuum is gradually going up and as we slide the pedal to the right cutting crate turns on and gradually increases. The last sub mode is a single cut. This sub-mode works like a scissors. While pressing the pedal down, the vacuum gradually increases and one side click makes a single cut. More videos you can find on our YouTube channel and retinacoach.com website. Subscribe to stay updated and also comment down below if you find this video useful. Thank you for your attention.